Huge story, guys. What do you think in terms of why Howard came out and why Caruso, the one to be chosen to start? Well, I don't think, well, I know Dwight Howard didn't play well in the last ball game. Get our best player involved in as many plays as possible, LeBron James. Good defense there from Davis. Forces the turnover, and James with the flush down the other end. Back to that in a moment. Great hands by Caruso getting back into the pitcher. James barrels in and banks it home. Lakers by three. Tyler Hero, nice little fake. Duncan Robinson has some room again. That's two three-pointers for Duncan Robinson already. They have missed some very makeable point-blank shots as James continues to attack in transition. Prouder on LeBron James. Nice feed inside to Rondo. Beautiful pass from James. That's his second assist. Miami shrinks defensively, but a tremendous cut and fine to Rondo. Bad pass from Hero. Caldwell Pope, the steal, drives down the other end and lays it up and in. Kendrick Nunn just into the game. He nails a three-pointer. He was huge for them in the last ball game. First year as head coach of the Lakers. It was Caldwell Pope lines up the three-pointer. That won't go. Davis fighting for it. Gets the offensive rebound. Back up and throws it down with authority. Davis. Butler's only taken 11 threes in these finals. Rondo drives and finishes. Rondo off the bench. Back to Nunn. Nice penetration from Nunn. Butler the corner jumper. Yes. Three-pointer for Jimmy Butler. Jimmy Butler. Davis spins against Iguodala. The baseline jumper, high floater is good. Anthony Davis, eight points here in the first. He's four of six from the field. And Goran Dragic is going to make his entrance after missing the last four games. Well, first of all, I don't think he's healthy and whole, but I think it's a harder decision than what you say as James attacks the rim without any help and one. Goran Dragic checks back in the game. How does that change things for you in terms of what you're trying to do out there, especially defensively? Well, we have coverages in place on how we want to, you know, uh, compete against Goran. James goes to the rim once again, lays it up and in, and he's in double figures. And a timeout called by Eric Spolstrup. Dragic chased by Danny Green, goes down the lane, high off the glass, yes. rattles around and drops in. Dragic with his first points in his return. Crowder to Butler. Butler drives on Kuzma. Little Euro step, flips it up and Jimmy rolls it in. Jimmy Butler now with six points. Rondo pushing the other way. Rondo drives another scoop layup, lays it up and in. 11 points for Rondo off the bench. Rondo. Shot clock down to five. Rondo gets across the lane, spins inside, left handed layup. Oh, Rajon Rondo putting on a show here in the first half. 13 points on six of six from the field. Crowder and rattles that one in. And boy, did the Miami Heat need that three pointer. Davis floats it up and in. Crowder on the drive. Crowder on the finish. Back-to-back -back buckets from Dre Crowder. Gets down the lane. Blocked by Davis. Saved by Caruso. What a defensive sequence by Anthony Davis. Caldwell Pope draws the foul. Banks at home and one. Contavious Caldwell Pope with a chance for a three-point play. Good ball denial from Caldwell Pope. Out of bio, a couple of dribbles. Nice feed inside to Butler. Butler changes, layup, count it, and the foul. Butler found an angle, drew some contact, and a chance for a three-point play. And he outworks them. And then Davis throws it down with the foul. Rondo with the perfect bounce pass. The lead is 20, and a chance for a three-point play. L.A. looking to push every opportunity. Beautiful pass. Caruso banks it in. Rondo drives, gets inside. Back out. Caldwell Pope for three. Puts it in. 61 to 34 with a minute to play here on the second. Then he defensive rebounds. He's basically playing center field and daring Bam to shoot as KCP knocks down another one. This is a clinic on both sides of the floor by the Lakers. They need more skill and shooting on the floor. Caruso with the steal. Caruso got the start. Doesn't have big numbers. As James drives, gets inside, layup, banks at home, and a foul. But Caruso has had a real impact, Jeff. Eight on the 24. James goes down a lane, kicks it out. Davis. Davis fakes. Back up top, Danny Green. An open look. That's good. Danny Green from downtown. Lakers are shooting 52% from the field. And then the 
Just complete miscommunication stopped defensively there as Adebayo able to slam it home. Hero just one for eight from the field tonight. James drives, James finishes. And the Lakers just keep pouring it on. With the Heat coming in with an opportunity to tie and force a game seven. As Bam Adebayo knocks down the jumper. This guy is far from finish. Adebayo gets inside, throws it up, draws the foul. Davis just picked up his fourth foul. Getting off the bench, he's going to come back in. As we approach the midway point of the third, Danny Green high off the glass, bounces around and drops through. Danny Green, eight points. Which is not an insult. It's a credit to greatness. Right, it's just a Sometimes you're fortunate to be at in the right place at the right time. I don't think those two guys are exceptionally talented. I mean, like you always say, like top five, but it's it's not like everybody else's defense and then timely performances by others. And you make a great point because as great as Anthony Davis has been this ball game in this ball game, as Rondo knocks down another jumper. The lead has ballooned to 36. How about the game Rondo's had? 16 points, seven of eight from the field as Crowder puts it up and in. Rondo's even hit a couple of three-pointers. Lakers have shot poorly from three-point land, but it certainly doesn't matter with what they've done at the other end as Dragic floats it up and in. Usual great spirit and defense. Back to James. James goes inside the flush and the foul. Two have had a, a terrific connection on the floor all season. James is one of Caruso's biggest fans as Butler goes in. And Jimmy Butler, who has been... To say the least, sensational. They're just two of six from the field. After that fantastic performance in game five, got that three-pointer to go. His third three-pointer, and it's 84-57. This is a Heat team that is a very good offensive team. Rondo again. Rajon Rondo. Eight of nine from the field. 19 points off the bench. It's up a little bit. Gets it to Adebayo. And Kelly Olenek knocks down a three. Olenek, who had some good moments earlier in the series when Adebayo got hurt. Lauren Dragic is going to be a free agent this offseason. Beautiful pass to Adebayo. Those two have been doing that all throughout these playoffs. You have to lose and have frustrating nights in order to develop and understand the adjustments that you have to make individually and collectively. Danny Green knocks down a three. It's so good to see. Lead back up to 25. Dragic, Butler, and Hero. Hero throws it up and in. As the Heat come the other way. Bam out of bio. Short jumper's good. And Frank Vogel calls timeout. Totally agree. You know, they have been just exceptional here in the postseason. Green shot won't go. Davis on the tip. Good defense from Caldwell Pope. We're talking about Hero's problem offensively. Part of that to do with the defense against him. Caldwell Pope is been terrific defensively as Olenek flips it back up and in. Out of bio inside, bounces around and drops in. He's improved defensively, he's improved as a passer as he draws more attention. LeBron James putting on the finishing touches as he knocks down the three-pointer. Hero inside, bam, out of bio, throws it up and in. Out of bio putting up Big numbers in a blowout loss. Going to finish the playoffs 16 and 5. They beat Portland, Houston, and Denver all in five games. As LeBron James ready to celebrate. James wants to finish off with a three. Instead, he'll go inside, lay it up and in. As we hit two minutes remaining here in game six. Final seconds here in this NBA season. The respect from those two. And that's it. It's over. This historic 2020 NBA championship belongs to the Los Angeles Lakers. The Lakers conquer the bubble, and banner number 17 will soon hang in the rafters.